and a lot of famous um, gowns are made by Filipino designers or whatsoever. So from around $200, you can find a good dress. You know, you can even fly all day Philippines buy a dress for two hundred dollars and go buy. <laughs> Anyway, this is Divisoria. I'm in Divisoria, Manila with my sister in Graces. We are shopping. We have a wedding. Remember, we have a wedding. And now it is just a few days away before the wedding is coming. Oh, so we are just doing last minute shopping. But I wanted to show you guys Divisoria. So we have four of us here. I'm with Abby. Right. Where's the bride? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with a <the> bride. <laughs> so this is inspired by the flag of the Philippines. Wow. It's so beautiful. I was looking how he's making at this Filipino flag. <laughs> it's so dark, it's so beautiful. So grand. How they put the sun. Maybe the sun can come on their head. Oh, I'm just like, wow. How many are you Oh, pero seven, Detail. And this is our bride. Yeah. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. We have a bride, Shopping. people. Wedding, you only oh, get what were you once. saying about creativity? Creativity, you just love, you know, Philippine people. I the know. Philippines are very creative oh. and they're very. One of the best talented. gowns in the world in the Philippines. Yes. Yes, look at that. That's why you see our beauty pageants. Yes. So proud. I know. <laughs> we saw the Catriona Grace gown. Uh -huh. yeah. so, this is where it is, the Divisoria. What? In the Philippines, one of the crowds. You can see. It's like the melting pot of where you see a lot of not very expensive gowns, but gorgeous gowns as well. So, yeah, this is where our dearest what artists got her. Our Philippines <laughs> I don't look Filipino. Ah, Every, everyone say, are you Japanese? Are you Korean? <laughs> I'm Filipino po. <laughs> but yeah. A lot of the people here in the Philippines were actually mixed race because a lot of Spanish come here, a lot of Chinese people come here and they mingled with the Filipinos. So now we have people uh, like you. <laughs> people like me. <laughs> but we still have the pure bed. I had a former classroom before. She was so gorgeous and she's very... Filipina, you know, her beauty is really Filipina, so we come in all shapes and sizes. <laughs> yeah. All right, yeah. so just look at this girl, amazing. Oh, look at this girl. Look at that. I know, what? All handmade. This is why you know oh, sure, Filipino sure, standards sure. are like up to here. <laughs> Because you have these gorgeous Alright. So we know your gown will be Look at that. Absolutely. It's so beautiful. This is like Filipiniana. So these are traditional clothes. Traditional. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Hi, Abby. Yeah, just for you. Stella's got mother. <laughs> so in Philippines, Christmas begins in September. Look at that, people. It's Christmas. So 
so it's very cheap cheaper than the one in the supermarket so yeah this is where we buy snacks and we're buying snack for tomorrow's bridal shower look at all that ay 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 Honestly speaking, uh, Divisoria is always the best place to come when you're looking for gown or you want to be bongacious. And my sister's wedding theme is royal, so all of us are supposed to show up royal. Huh? I'm telling you. See, we are on many levels. about your dresses I am I'm doing a feature on wedding dresses in the Philippines and how you need to buy your wedding dresses in the Philippines uh, it's really to wear mom uh, we have sizes mm, all sizes and these are really handmade by hand yeah um, yes mom so what is the price range of uh, the eight, dresses eight five eight thousand five hundred to twenty five thousand oh that's so affordable so yes. from around two hundred dollars you can find a good dress you know you can even fly the eight philippines buy a dress for two hundred dollars and go <laughs> this is where i bought my wedding dress by the way i bought 10 years ago <laughs> nine years ago all right and this is the making of the dress
Um, yeah, so Atelier is wanting me to talk about why here in the Philippines we're known to be one of the best, um, I don't know what you call them, the seamstress. Yeah, the seamstress, right? Our gowns are really good and even a lot of famous um, gowns are made by Filipino designers or whatsoever. So she wanted to feature in one of the wedding gowns here in the Philippines. Aside that it's, it's more cost efficient than other countries, um, I believe it has something to do with the culture that we're a melting pot. That's why the creativity is really um, complex. You know, it has a touch of Western, it's a touch of Asian, and a touch of uh, you know Spanish touch. So yeah, so it's just we're here in Divisoria. We're known for not really cheap. You cannot say cheap because they're actually still expensive. But comparing from other um, boutiques, is that what you call the the down the boutiques? Here in Divisoria, you can find a variety of of gowns. Well, you know, like this one, the sequins, and and different designs. So yeah, what's the other question? <laughs> well, what are no, you asking? No other question. Uh, so we're done gown shopping for our bride. Yeah, we're done shopping for our bride. Actually, here in Divisoria, if you previously got married. Going to Divisoria makes you want to get married again. Again. Because yeah. of the gowns. Yes. Not because of the whole marriage thing, but <laughs> because of the gowns. It's really fun. It's an exciting um, uh, place. So let's ask Ate. Ate, how long have you been doing this? How long have you been years. Huh? See, and these people do it for life. I mean, I'm sure they do it because it's also pa it's also their passion. Like, if you can look at this other gown as well. These are all handmade. It's not made by machine. So each piece is really done by hand. The materials are are also, you know, I'm not good at any materials. I'm not an expert, but you can really see the layers. The stuffs are really different. And what's also good about the Visoria is everything is here. The the tela, the the linen, the cloth, the jewelry, the sequins, and and the people here are really professional. So like uh, the the seamstress and also the Courtier, what do you call them? The, the, the women who really does the gowns, court, courtier. Please comment down below. I cannot, I cannot pronounce it. But they're, they're, they are also here. They're not just seamstress, but they're also really uh, well known um, you know, designers. So, yeah, so um, fun fact for family fun fact. I think Liz's outfit was also bought here. My other sister in law's clothes were also bought here. My brother's wife now also got her gowns here so this place really has everything and especially now it has been improved it has good parking space it's cleaner and um, there's air conditioned here so uh, I don't know if Vivisoria will sponsor this video <laughs> <laughs> Buy the material. You just get the material. Yeah. Shopping until we are 
drop in, guys. <laughs> Woo! These guys can shop. Bless you, bro. How many hours now have we been watching? We've been here for five hours. Oh wow. Five hours. Yes. And counting. What is I'm the Tagalog? <laughs> what's the Tagalog for plants? Plants. Tagalog what for no, I, I can't remember what I've never ha. known. Ha. <laughs> ha. Until the the shops are closing, guys. It's a wrap. Yes. And it's a wrap, people. Thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe to our channel at We Are All Comfort and the notification bell. Please look forward to the wedding that is coming up. That is our baby sister getting married. Uh, this is the season of wedding in the Campo family and we're excited, sad, mixed emotions because she's going, oh, she's getting married. But anyway, uh, this is life, life happens. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you're a bride, please get your wedding dress from the Philippines. Alright, that is it from us. Bye-bye.